If you're anything like me, you've probably had a little toy as a kid or a little fabric friend who you pretty much took everywhere. You know, you took it to the park, to the beach, to see friends, you know, you slept with it, you took it to the toilet. Moving along. Guff by Aaron Blavy is for anyone that has ever had a fabric friend that they've taken everywhere and that they've loved and adored. This is another book by Aaron Blavy. You can't get wrong with Aaron. You know, everything he writes is pretty much gold. And this one is his latest. We've got signed copies of this book, so you might want to get in quick. And the only reason I say that is because Aaron Blaby's other series, one of his other series is called The Bad Guys. It's actually going to be turned into a Hollywood film. So he's gonna become super, super famous. He's already pretty big in Australia, but the whole world is gonna know him. So you are going to want to have a book signed by this man. One of Australia's most beloved authors, Kate Forsyth, she returns with her latest book. This one is called Beauty in Thorns, and it's this wonderful sleeping, sleeping beauty reimagining set in the pre-Raphaelite times. Now, the pre-Raphaelites, they were a group of seven young um, writers and painters who, in 1848 in London, they really wanted to shake up the art of the time because they thought it was kind of really dull and antique looking, kind of brown. They really wanted artwork that was kind of represented reality and that it was luminous and colorful and they really wanted to be inspired and draw from like fairy tales and mythology and poetry and that's what they really set out to do. And so even though this little brotherhood was only around for like five years, they're in their influence spread far and wide. So they influenced everything from home design and decoration to clothing to art. And what Beauty and Thorns is, is this wonderful story that's set in the, you know, the pre aphelite times that weaves together, you know, loss and love and obsession. If you're interested in this time period, you are going to want to read this book. Jeffrey Diva, internationally best-selling thriller writer. He came to Booktopia and he chatted with us. And he chatted about this book, which is The Burial Hour. It's the 13th book in his Lincoln Rhyme series. Now you've probably heard the series. Um, it all started many, many years ago with The Bone Collector, which if you haven't read the book, you've probably seen or heard about the movie, which was made in the 90s, if I'm not mistaken, and it starred Angelina Jolie and Denzel Washington. So The Bone Collector was written by this guy in this series. We have a wonderful podcast with Jeffrey on SoundCloud. Um, and he talks about how in this book in particular, it took him, wait for it, eight months to actually write the outline of this book. And then when he finished writing the outline, he wrote a 150 page summary of the book before even writing the book. That's 150 pages, like some books are 150 pages and his summary of this book was that, that length. So you'll find more interesting tidbits of information like that on our podcast with him. This particular book in my hand is actually a signed copy by Jeffrey Diva. Read the description of this Facebook post to find out how you can win this particular book. Thanks for watching guys. If you want to win this book, you know what to do. Check out Facebook. See ya.